everybody my name is varuni khosla i write for the economic times uh, i'd like to welcome you today to insta class by amity online um just to give you a sense uh, i've been a journalist for about 12 and a half years now of which a majority of my career has been spent at the economic times i've done fairly interesting things in this uh, sort of space i was actually hired to do hospitality news um and then i my role shifted to writing about education and hr and then after that i've sort of evolved into writing about you know luxury businesses and lifestyle companies news features essentially on these businesses um i thought you know it's a, it's a late evening today it's a friday night but you know it might be interesting to take everybody through to my journey <laughs> uh i don't think i was ever intending to be a journalist uh i was studying at lsr college in delhi and um, after my graduation was done i wasn't really sure where i was going so i picked up uh, all the courses and all the tests that were available in journalism and i went ahead and gave them all to my surprise i got through the asian college of journalism and then i ended up um well at mint newspaper and uh, it, through my campus hire and it was it was it was fairly interesting journey and i quite enjoyed myself to be very honest um but the one interesting thing about journalism is that every day is a different day you can't go into the newsroom thinking that today is going to be the best day for me and today i'm going to do this and this is my to do list the through the course of the day the entire journey changes you don't know what is going to hit you you don't know when it's going to come but it's actually a lot of fun um at least i have learned to uh, love it a lot um as far as luxury and lifestyle journalism is concerned the biggest misconception that many young people have is the fact that there is a lot of glamour in this space there is a lot of glamour don't get me wrong there are a lot of these um evening soirees and events to attend but the hard part of it is that not a lot of people know about is the fact that you actually have to study i have to study a lot of balance sheets um just to give you an example without naming a particular company that i was writing on i had to study 38 of their balance sheets in order to write a one page feature on them just last year um it's a very big space in the luxury uh, business in india um and there's a lot to be written about the pandemic was quite an interesting challenge also as far as uh, i i was concerned we thought there would be nothing really to write about when it came to uh, you know the malls being shut or people not being able to go there and uh, but surprisingly luxury managed to make quite a recovery people were shopping because they were tired of sitting at home uh, they were locked in and businesses started booming or at least international brands that were selling luxury here started booming so um, it was quite a turn around yes indian fashion designers didn't do too well um, but as far as we were concerned stories were just coming so what my gist is essentially is that you need to have a nose for news and you need to know exactly what you're looking for and you need to be able to build the right contacts in this space because you're not just going to get stories from reading newspapers alone you're going to have to meet people and you're going to have to meet them every day every few days call them up be in touch with them there's a lot that can be done but you need to be able to have the right kind of contacts in this space um i leave the last sort of one minute for anybody who would like to ask me a question um let me know guys is other than waving at me is there anything you'd like to add okay i don't think there's a lot to be said but um guys please put your sort of uh, heads down understand why you want to be a journalist um get your reason straight before you get into it and sorry let me just read that question are you happy in what you're doing yes i am actually very happy with what i'm doing it's as i told you every day is a new day it's very very exciting for me um i don't think any other kind of career uh, promises this kind of uh, excitement every day any more questions from anyone super uh thanks for today guys if you want to look me up uh give me a call uh, find me on linkedin i'm available i'll help you i'll help you understand find contacts just let me know i'm always here for help 
Super, thank you. Thank you.